Hi Prabhu here today we will see about how to model a complex shape in maya part 6 stay tuned before that if you won't subscribe to this youtube channel click on this red color subscribe button to subscribe this youtube channel we post weekly free videos about maya 2017 arnold modeling texturing and lighting so if you won't subscribe click this red color subscribe button and subscribe to this youtube channel okay in this part we see about create sets quick selection set and also edit mesh poke face so it's really important to change the edge direction so see here i have some example so in this trash bin there is lot of holes but it's not in straight direction so the holes will be in this direction like this so how to do that go to maya go to create panel polygon primitives disable the interactive creation that means when we click on poly cylinder it will automatically create it in center of grid press r and scale b and also in y go to front view press 4 in keyboard to see wireframe mode press w i want to move in y now press right click and choose vertex select this bottom vertex and press r and scale in mid go to perspective press 5 in keyboard select the stop vertex press control f11 when the vertex selected press control f11 in keyboard that means the vertex will be convert as a face press delete in keyboard now we need to add an edge loop go to insert edge loop option box here you need to choose Uh, reset the tool and add edge loop over here and also here now double click on this edge shift right click and choose bevel edge and view fraction amount to 0. Point 0.1 and segments to 2 now right click and choose object mode here you need to add multiple edge loop shift right click and choose insert edge loop option box here i want to choose multiple edge loop i will give number of edge loop to 10 so you need to add over here now i want to change this direction edge direction it's normally flow in straight but i want to change my edge direction using quick selection set so go to perspective you need to select so select the stage shift double click on the stage you need to select all the way so don't select the bottom and top edge because the holes only happen on here to here so that means you want to only select this edge okay and also you need to select this edge also okay after you select all these things go to create and choose set and choose quick selection set so it will save our selection so in this case i will rename my selection as edge and click okay 
now go to front view and select this face over here so don't select the top and bottom region you need only select the center part and go to edit mesh and choose poke so that means our edge will be change our direction now I want to clear my trace over here when the object selected go to select and quick selection set so we already save as edge so select this one so that means our saved edge will be selected press control backspace in keyboard so that means our edge will be gone so now you able to see our edge direction will be changed over here so as we seen in this reference image now we need to select this face over here go to front view and select this face and go to perspective shift right click and choose extrude face I want to change my keep face together to off so you need to sorry keep face together to on and click over here and scale like this sorry you need to give keep face together to off so now you able to see each and every face extrude separately when we turn off the keep face together and also you need to scale like this and press delete so that means you got holes but we need to add some thickness before that I will double click on this edge shift right click and choose extrude edge and press W I want to move in Y and press R and scale like this so now I want to double click on the edge shift right click and choose bevel edge so I want to reduce my fraction amount and use segments to 2 now right click and choose object mode shift right click and choose extrude you need to extrude in Z now double click on the edge shift double click on the edge shift right click and choose bevel edge and do fraction to 0.2 and segment to 2 now right click and choose object mode and press 3 in keyboard to smooth our object so now you able to see our holes will be in zigzags zigzag way as we seen in our reference image so this is the way to use a quick selection set and also poke face so I hope you like it I see you on next project. Click subscribe button to subscribe our YouTube channel. We always need your support to create high quality content further. So please subscribe. Click here to also watch the tutorial of what is topology. It's really helpful to model a perfect shape.